Hello YouTubers and welcome to Destination Lego and welcome to a rather special but unusual unboxing video. So just to explain special because to me this is a special unboxing because it is the cafe corner um, and this was the only modular building which I personally did not own. Um, as you can see I've managed to pick, pick a set up. Um, it is a boxed set. It's not a sealed box set so it is a um, second hand set which I purchased off of Bricklink. Um, I may put a link down to the Bricklinker store in the description at the time of recording this video. I'm just waiting for him to uh, confirm whether he wants me to do that or not. So it may or may not be there. Um, I've also done a Lego haul video. So I think that's Lego haul 83 I think. Um, but I'll put a link down in the description to this video for that. Where you can see me um, actually... Um, receiving this and unboxing it as part of the lego haul um, but now i'm actually going to do an unboxing as in get all the pieces out of the uh, main cafe corner um, box there um, i'm not going to get all the bits out i mean this is um, the second part obviously why it's unusual it's unusual because it's not a sealed set so i'm not unboxing a brand new sealed set i'm unboxing a used set um, but i thought i'd just share the experience with you guys um, and also just to see how well packaged the bits are in here for if it's anything to go by um, the exterior um, package that this came in was absolutely amazing it was fantastic uh, very very well packaged indeed and again if you look down in the uh, description and click on that link for lego hall number 83 i believe um, you'll see what that looked like so let's get into this okay so first off you can see it obviously is boxed it is set number 10182 um, ages 16 plus and it comes with 2056 pieces so we get to see the main cafe corner itself here over here on this side there are a couple of pictures that shows the dimensions of the set um, and then here obviously there is a modular style so the um, uh, first and second floors do separate from the ground floor okay and round to the rear of the box um, again we have um, some pictures here um, showing some of the details on the cafe corner itself over on this side um, just a look I guess inside some of those floors um, what that looks like inside um, again a picture there of the exterior um, here we have trying to work out what that is actually because I haven't built this yet and that's maybe something else that you can buy it from uh, sorry buy it from build not entirely sure actually I think there might be an alternative build looking at because it's got the same color pieces in it I suspect that's an alternative build but not entirely sure and apologies for that um, and interestingly if you look down the bottom and I'll try and zoom in a little bit more push that back because you certainly don't get this now obviously we have here times one what it looks like that's what it can look like if you build two of these together um, stacking them up two side by side and this beast over here is times six <laughs> so if you were ever lucky enough to have bought six of these you could do that monster of a building then it does look really awesome actually but the likelihood of getting hold of six of these now is um well you could do it but it would cost a lot of money um, just while we're there round to the edge there and you can see hotel um, on that side, uh, if we go around to that side again, just another shot of the cafe corner itself, right flat. There we can see um, the minifigures and some of the accessories that come in the set. And then finally round to this side, um, it's upside down, I'm not going to turn it over, but that's the inventory piece count in there and the minifigure to scale. Okay, so now with the actual opening up of the box, like I said, it's not sealed, so we can just lift the lid up, like so, and I do want to be careful with this, because obviously I want to protect the box. Um, like I said, this is a bricklinker that's done this, so first of all, he's packaged it with lots of bubbles, bubbles, air bubbles in there, loads of them all packed in, absolutely fantastic. I'm just going to see them all there, and all these bubbles, we'll put those down on the floor for a minute. I will keep those to put in here um, and then inside again amazingly packaged by the looks of it <laughs> absolutely fantastic so we've got all the pieces together 
I mean, what a great job this brick linker has done. He must have spent a lot of time doing this. This is going to make it a bit easier for me to build it. Literally, every element is together. Tiles, bricks, they're all together. Um, let's get a smaller one here. Okay, we've got exactly the same in this bag here as well. All the pieces together. Uh, another bag here. And again, you can see in there again, look, you see those little one by one tiles there together. Again, there, those pieces all together. Absolutely fantastic. So, so far, I mean, this brick linker has been outstanding. Absolutely outstanding. Um, and again, in here, <laughs> you can see again, all the same pieces are together. You can see there, the windows. I mean, this person has taken some real care uh, and time to do what he's done here so my thanks to him I hope he does see this video and watch this video um, and here I'm guessing this is going to be the instructions so if we just open up this box oh, that is sealed there so let me just grab my oh, can I open it this way even in here we've got some polystyrene packing wow Grab my knife, guys. <coughs> Gently cut down here. Okay, so this should just open up now. And it does, and even in there, you can see the polystyrene little beads in there. Absolutely brilliant again. Uh, we have in here, actually, to start with, the base plates. Um, obviously two green base plates for the cafe corner to go on and then finally we have the instruction manual uh, which you can see there which looks like again that is in very good condition he did say that there were a couple of loose pages in it um, so I'm just going to get this out of here let's just pause the video for a minute get this out and I'll be back Okay, so we are back and here are the instruction manuals. Looks like there are, yes, there are two. There you can see there, book book one of two and book two of two. So we have both books. Let's just put that one down to one side. And there we can see where we get to at the end of the first book by the looks of it. Again, considering the age, this is a set from 2007. Uh, at the time of recording this, it is mm, end of May 2015, getting towards the end of May. So quite a few years old, and considering that, this I have to say this is in very good condition. Um, so no issues with that first manual. Uh, next manual. Okay. And we can see all the builds continuing, I just want to see what's in the back. It looks like we get to the final area, so that's the cafe corner all built there. Then we have the inventory piece count on one, two and three pages. Uh, we then have the cafe corner uh, there. There's that other building, um, which I'm assuming is an alternative build um, that you can build out of these pieces. It's interesting. Um, oh, then again, we have the times two, times two side by side, I'm assuming we're going to have this beast, there we are, um, and then, oh, times three this time, there we can do a times three, uh, and indeed times six, and that is just a monster, I mean, that is just huge, I so wish I had six sets of these, I really do, um, has anyone got six sets, let me know down in the comments, I'll be very interested to hear, or indeed see, or if anyone knows if there's any links on YouTube, I'd love to see six sets of these um, built in that configuration like that and see what it's like next to some of the other modular buildings. So if anyone can help with that, let me know. But um, yeah, that's the instructions Lego Club on the back. Uh, yeah, there we go. So that's instruction manual number two. So there we go, there's my rather special and unusual unboxing video of the Cafe Corner in all its glory. Hopefully you did enjoy this video, hopefully you did, if you did, give it that big thumbs up. 
Um, let me know what you think of this set, the first modular building um, ever um, that was released by Lego, inspired by a uh, Lego uh, user, just like us. Um, like I said, any comments, questions, feedback, leave down in that comments section. And if you haven't done so already, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel, Destination Lego. And also look down in the link to the description of this, also rather sorry, look down in the description to this video for other links to one, my other uh, channel, which is my vlog channel. I'm trying to get some more subscribers on that, so please go ahead and click on that link um, for my vlog channel. There you will find videos to do with Lego, but also other things as well. Like for example, I think one of my most recent videos was me um, unboxing my latest purchase, which was a MacBook Pro from Apple. Anyway guys, I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Cheers, bye for now.